All right, everybody. So I am going to show you something that I just got in the mail from um, someone that reached out to me. It's called the regulator, and this helps you set up your boards for cornhole at the same distance every single time. So I had already taken out of the bag. I wanted to look at it real quick. Um, so it's called the regulator again, and it attaches with three screws on the inside of the cornhole board as close to the frame as possible. So right above the hole, if you're looking from the top down or the bottom, because this is your legs here, so it attaches right there. What you do is this would be attached underneath. You'd reach inside the hole and you pull this out all the way to the front of the other board and it should put you right at 27 feet. I'm going to test this out and see how it goes. So again, this is something that I uh, liked the idea of. Um, I don't have any systems in place for my boards right now. So they reached out out of nowhere and I definitely was like, yeah, I'll give that a try. So, I mean, Seems pretty simple. I don't know how you can mess it up, but the only thing I'm a little iffy about is frames can always be different on boards, and I want to see how accurate this is. So, all right, let's check it out. All right, so let's install this. You have the regulator, and they supply you with three screws. I'm going to legs up I'll place that in the middle there actually I'm just using that because I know that that's almost dead center All right, simple enough. Let's see how uh, accurate this is. What are you doing? All right, so I have my board set up. We're gonna measure them and get them set at exactly 27 feet. Come on down, Come over here. Okay, let go. 25, 26. Seven. All right. So I'm going to slide my board up over here. Eight, 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 seven. All right. That's good. This is the first time I've used this regulator. So reach under. Grab this. Let me walk you guys through this. Now, I have... Down, get down, please. I have mine uh, half-inch offset, and I have three-quarter ply, so you have an inch and a quarter that this regulator is backed up against. All right, get off now. So, and that could vary if you're, if you're doing flush frames. Um, there could be a little variance there. So, um, but this thing's pretty freaking close. All right, so I'm all the way, all the way out. Can't pull it down anymore. And I am about, I would say, um, it depends on where you measure from. So I'm about, and I'm stretching this thing. So if I just, I can feel it kind of click back right there. So I could utilize this and just measure right from that knot every time. Um, but if I pull it full extension, I'm about an inch and a half. Um, 
But again, if you did flush mount frames, that would bring you back about an inch and a quarter, give or take, and you'd be pretty dang close. So I would say, um, you know, once this is on your board and you figure out, all right, detent, there's a little detent at the end. So I bring it back and I'm right at that knot. So I don't know, I think this is uh, pretty neat. I wouldn't just let this sling back, but uh, you know, again, this is the first time I've used it. You guys seen me put it on. Um, I, uh, I'm definitely a fan as of right now. I'll put it through some runs. I'm going to test it out a few times before I put this video on probably. Um, but as of right now, things pretty smooth. So I will have some information in the description below again. So it's mounted under here. You can see it right there. It's hidden. I don't, I don't, I don't see if it has any problems with bags. Um, I'm not sure right now. Something to test.